morning. So it's uh, quarter to two in the morning and I'm on the highway north again. Destination today is Brisbane Airport where I'll meet Rochelle and the kids. They're flying up and we'll be picking up our new uh, Jayco Expander. I knew I'd be doing the bulk of the driving on this trip at night. So I pinched the light bar off bullet truck and um, the combination of my halogen light force and the, and the LED light bar, it's actually pretty good. I'm not sure that bullet truck's gonna get that light bar back now. Daybreak has given me a second wind. So Maroubra to Coffs Harbour in five hours and 20 minutes. So we're just coming across the border. It's taken me 10 hours and 20 minutes from my door to Shelley's pickup point. Not bad. Okay, so I've collected Shell and the kids. Hooray! And uh, we've just come around the corner. Basically, she's very close to the airport. And there's our new van. Check her out. Oh, that's cool. You want to take your shoes off already? We haven't bought it yet. So, what's your first impression? Check out the bunks. Which bunk's yours? The bottom one. First uh, real off-road test of the new Outback. Stingray Mills. Stingray Millie coming your way, hun. Stay in Mills. There, see? It's up in front of you. See it? Yeah. You're really low. Keep going that way. That door is just above. Oh. Yeah, the side said no, but the door's about to go under. Yeah, it's out now. That was deep maiden voyage into the bush with the outback pretty successful we got in here it was quite high the tide but we're still hitched up tonight we're gonna to do one night here before we move on to a place further north and um, look at this for an outlook pretty good eh? with a bit of surf we've also got gauges showing us voltage in water consumption out of the tank really handy. Big wardrobe setup. From the top bunk. Tonight Millie's view. Tonight and tomorrow morning. Look at Millie's view. She's going to be here in the ocean. A great overnight stop at one of our most favourite east coast beaches. So now we're going to get back onto the main beach and then off the main beach which will be another test for the Jayco.
Okay, so we've done all the hard stuff. We've come off the beach. What we'll do now is we'll air up the caravan. Take them up to about 25. They've been on 16 for the soft stuff. Looking forward to seeing how this JTEC independent suspension works too. So we spent our first night in the new van and now we're going to take it on um, some dirt. Uh, a bit of a 10 k's of pretty bad corrugations, so we're going to air down. So this is our spot for New Year's Eve, New Year's Day. Pretty lush, pity we haven't got rubber ducky here. Van set up on the spot that we're going to be for the next couple of nights. And this one's got a stereo in it with speakers externally. Kids are loving it. We're, we're right on the back of this beach here. Pretty cool. And this stereo here is what feeds that nice sounding music. So let's have a quick look inside it. So this, this is the expander with bunks. It's five years old. That's the adults side. It's got um, table and chairs, very similar to the old one. This is the expander we've been chasing for a while with the bunks, so it doesn't pull out like the adult side, keeping the kids separate. Bit of a feed while we wait for the tide, so we're not going to starve. Oh, here we go. We're very close now to the car. We've oh. definitely run out of beach. What? What? Danny is parking on higher ground. The water came in and it splashed away, so we have to go and move off a bit. Right up high on this sand. It's okay, it's still got a fair bit of uh, traction in it. How good is it having the shower in the truck to wash the salt off straight away? Right kids? Yeah. Yep. Almost back at camp, full tide. How lush is that? Go. Oh, you did do it. So the conclusion to our maiden voyage with the new expander is that uh, we love it. Uh, the suspension works. It soaks up so much stuff that the leaf springs didn't. Uh, you look in your rearview mirror and you see vans basically staying still and wheels are doing what they've got to even though the land cruisers jumping Going. around here and there the empty ball mass surprisingly to me uh, is exactly the same it's 145 kilos yet the uh, 
the expander is a half a ton heavier. Folding it down is just a matter of unlocking this bar here and just pulling it, making sure the canvas all comes in nicely. There's that side. And then this side. Simple as that. Thanks for watching.